we're here with heavy Jerry Forrest. Oh. heavyweight Jerry Forrest, as he just let you know, from Newport News, Virginia. Jerry, uh, we came here tonight to see you fight, but we hear that uh, half the equation's missing. Can you tell us what happened? He pulled out. You know, uh, this man already talked the whole night before the fight. He was at the weigh-in. He thought he he's a no-show tonight. We were already dressed, gloved up, getting ready to put the mouthpiece in. And I thought he was back in the dressing room. I didn't know that uh, no one went back there to fight. And who is this... Uh, Opponent in absence that we're talking about? Uh, Wayne Hampton? Wayne Hampton. Wayne, Wayne Hampton. Hampton. Okay. Wayne Hampton. So, uh, where you at? What do you think? Did he get Did he get scared? What happened here? We don't know. We don't we, know, man. We physically, we hope that he's fine. I'm hoping that maybe he wasn't carjacked or, you know, uh, had a bad accident. But he's not here. His trainer waited for him. He's been calling. He's very apologetic. Bottom line is that, you know, we come a long way up here from Newport News, hotel rooms and all that stuff. And uh, unfortunately, we thought we had a pugilist who wanted to fight us. We found out we had a dud. He's not here. Now, Jerry, we've been following him. We had a reporter at your last fight. Uh, what's coming up for Jerry, manager Sharif Saleem? Well, we're looking to be on the Fight for Children card November the 1st. That's in Washington, D.C., I believe, at the Hilton Hotel. I'll be there. So hopefully that opponent will show. And we might possibly be going out west sometime in November as well to fight. So we kind of keep these fights going once a month. Because he needs to be active. He needs to build on confidence and record and everything else. We need to put some enough fights in the can for things like this that could happen. And unfortunately, I've been in the business a long time. I've never had anyone that show up the day of the fight that showed up, took his medical and didn't wait. He waited at 250. Did you see 250? Nice. We don't see 250. I mean, we would have even accepted 300 or 205. We did our part. Yeah, yeah, so can't be mad at us. Sold tickets. So family, friends are up here from Norfolk and Chesapeake and Virginia Beach. All these people are here and no fight. So now, disappointed. But we, you do have big plans for Jerry. We even hear maybe taking boxing back to Newport News. Can you tell us about well, that? We hope to do a show down there very soon. We're looking at the latter part of February to do something at Hampton Coliseum and uh, highlight some of the uh, vast amount of talent that's in that Tidewater area for Jerry. And, uh, but before then, you know, we got to stay busy. So we got uh, possibly a couple of fights in DC in November and December. Maybe one out of it. And Jerry, you got anything last to say? Obviously, maybe a little frustrated. We're going to keep training. We're going to keep winning. We're not going to stop. And uh, I guess next time I'm going to line up two or three more opponents, man, just in case somebody falls like we had the first fight, you know. But it is what it is. I did my part. You know, we train hard. You know, we've been in camp. We hit the road. You know, and we fell back. But we'll be back next time. You know, hopefully November 1st is a different story. Hopefully we get to fight out west. Fight December and uh, February, you know. So, if all goes well, I'm gonna take the stuff off the internet, you know, so guys can't see my highlights and kind of back out stuff sometimes. You know, guys can keep the contract, you know, keep the word. You know, it's not like back in the day when you know people wanted to fight. You know, they, they want to fight somebody good. They want to fight a hard hit. It's not like that no more. But it is what it is. So we we'll just keep on training. Whatever happens, happens. You know? We're here with heavyweight Jerry Forrest who today found out only in boxing. This is a stiff jab.